Brittany Cartwright admitted that she didn't know if she would be with her husband Jax Taylor forever on Tuesday's episode of The Valley on Bravo. I've asked Jax to do the smallest things to help our marriage, like therapy or just being nice to me, Brittany, 35, said in a confessional. And he's still not doing it. I'm definitely feeling like we might not be together forever. Brittany spoke to Janet Caprina about Jax and how it seemed like he made it seem like she had a drinking problem during the group trip to Big Bear. Janet said she just didn't think they were communicating. I know you guys don't believe in divorce and would never go down that path, Janet said. Oh, we would go down that path, Brittany said. In a confessional, Brittany said that saying the word divorce to Janet is definitely the first time I've ever said it out loud. I had to say it. It's very scary because I never ever thought I would feel this way. I feel like I'm going to cry, Brittany said and Janet hugged her. Brittany said she didn't feel comfortable with her body and they don't have sex ever. If you guys don't do something about this soon it's going to get bad, Janet said. The episode titled Dark Side Danny opened with the ladies holding a surprise baby shower for Janet while the guys went fishing. Michelle Lally, 36, told Brittany that she thought therapy had been good for her husband Jesse. Do you feel like you want to be in a marriage at all? Brittany said. I do and I don't, Michelle said. Are you still attracted to him still? Brittany asked. Not really, Michelle said. I want to feel the way I did for him. Michelle said she didn't want to be the bad person but that she wasn't happy. I never thought I would get to a place like this, Michelle said. Janet woke up and almost cried when she saw the surprise baby shower party. They set up fun baby shower games for them including chugging from a baby bottle. The ladies told her stories about their baby birth. The guys returned and Janet told them for dinner everyone was to dress up as their sexual fantasies. Jason Caprina, 40, dressed up in a hot dog outfit. Michelle put fake tattoos on Jesse, 39. I actually look good with a lot of tattoos. Maybe I should tattoo it up, Jesse said. I like it actually, Michelle said. Maybe I can actually get someone to sleep with me, Jesse said. Danny Bucco, 40, tried to dress up as Jamie Fraser from Outlander because his wife, Nia, 34, had watched the show three times all the way through. Nia had planned to dress up as a bottle of ranch dressing, but neither of their costumes arrived. Jax dressed up as a basketball player and Jesse dressed up as Harry Styles. Harry Styles will bow to the Lord, Daniel said. The chef told them that their dishes would have an aphrodisiac component. Danny kept driving during dinner. If we learned one thing this trip is that Danny is very sensitive, Jack said in a confessional. We need a new word for how lit Danny is tonight, Janet said in a confessional. It's just giving mess. I'll take a Scottish whiskey, Danny said. I don't think that's Nia's fantasy, Michelle said. Nia said she wanted to stay in her area and not move out to Santa Clarita. Danny said that had a 22-square-foot penthouse condo and they were already bursting at the seams. What I make and we make collectively, this is what we can afford, Danny said and in the valley is where we need to be looking. Nia tried to get Danny to talk to her and not to the table. You effed me over, Danny said. You just said the F word on national television to me, Nia said. Nia told him to have some water. Danny said he was so tired and Nia told him to go to bed.